How to use product board beginner's guide step by step. Hi there guys, in this video I'll be talking about product board right here and how you can start using the platform. So first off, let's talk about what product board is. Product board is a customer centric product management platform. It helps product managers understand what customers need to prioritize, what to build next, and rally everyone around their roadmap. So if you want to start out their free trial right here, you don't need to enter your credit card details and there is a free 15 day trial. You can request a demo by clicking this button right over here, but let's go right away to the app. I've already made my way inside the application by creating an account. It's simple, create an account with Google, and then you can set up your business or the type of work that you do. And then once you've done that, you'll be able to see this quick start guide page right over here. So there are three plans. We have the essentials pro and the scale for the essentials. You can organize plan and prioritize your feature ideas, build a delivery plan roadmap for your uh, product team and uh, invite colleagues to collaborate. We'll be uh, talking about this uh, essential features. And first thing that you can do is organize plan and prioritize your feature ideas. So initially I've inputted the three ideas, feature ideas, um, which is create a new book, organize a book launch, organize a seminar. Now each idea is right here. You can add in like a sub idea by clicking this plus button and you can then input a lot more stuff to do under this feature idea. You can see here three columns. We have drivers, effort, and releases, right? So the drivers, let me go ahead and talk you through. This one uh, lets you s score or like rank your, for all, this is like the, 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 keeps on showing up, complete. Okay, so you guys, uh, the drivers and scores, basically the value right here, it pays to consider, it says here, it pays to consider how much each proposed feature contributes to meeting critical drivers that most impact your product success, like usability, performance, security, and some drivers may be long-term, while others may vary quarter to quarter. Now calculate a prioritiz prioritization score for each feature by determining which of your drivers, drivers factor into the score and how they weighted out of 100%. Optionally, divide your score by effort. So let me just go ahead and put a score here on the create a new book. Like this is the most important part or this is the most important out of these three. I ranked it first right here. So I'm going to go ahead and um, put the value to this. And then the effort, I'm going to go ahead and um, put in like a manual. So let me just go ahead and 90%. All right. The effort, by the way, ranges from one to a hundred and it's going to be up to you you know, so this one, you can use this field to capture effort estimates for each feature, right? So it can be factored into the prioritization score or the scores for individual objectives. It can also be visualized on the features boards matrix grouping to help you evaluate the feasibility of features within each objective. This is pretty useful, you guys. Now that we've inputted, um, uh, the effort, let's check out value slash effort score. So this one is usually, um, yeah, it's, it's one and it's usually, uh, how to compute this is like, you'll just have to, uh, here you go. Let me just go ahead and check this out. All right. So the priorities in score, or you can create multiple priorities because the pro plan, this one is for the pro plan, you guys. All right, so you divide score by effort. So you'll have to divide value by effort and whatever uh, the score is, you get it here. So for the releases, now for uh, this, um, you can add features to releases that represent when they'll be available. Releases can be discrete, broad time horizons, uh, relative time frames or a hybrid of the above granular releases in the short term and broad time horizons in the midterm. Right. Okay. So release one and release two, 25 min. This is, uh, by the way, the company that um, pseudo name that I inputted. So you can add in more feature by clicking this drop down icon here, and then you can add a feature, add component or Im import. Features. So we also have a um, separate tab here, Slack messaging app. So if you want to use Slack and integrate it, you can do so using this section right over here. And 
What else you can do? You can check out the roadmaps right here. Aside from uh, the features, um, the roadmap, you can include uh, this template. So you can start with a template sprint plan or monthly launch roadmap features, timeline roadmap. Uh, essentially, we're working with features right now. So let me just go ahead and choose this. And then I can just choose a template. <laughs> All right. So this is the template. So you can see that it's linear. So if you want to input like a task or something, you can just go ahead and um, click on a box and then just click on the drop down icon here and then add it. Um, add in if it's going to be for 25 min or for the Zach messaging app. It's just sample product, by the way. So, all right, now let's hit on this one, organize a seminar. Okay, so you can see the feature that we have inputted is already here on the roadmap, right? Now, these are just uh, sample data, you guys. So when you go ahead and um, try to put more features here, you can just go ahead and add them here on your roadmap so that you'll have a clearer view of when are the features needed to be done or when are the ideas needed to be or needed to come to life, right? Okay, so what else we have? The insights right here, it's for Pro. So what can you do here is to connect customer feedback to features, validate feature ideas with customers. You can, can let's explore here and see what it does. Okay, so this one, all right, you will have to, apparently you'll have to pay for it. Okay. But by the way, uh, let's check out uh, the plans over here, Essentials Pro and Scale. For the Pro one, I've already talked about what you can do here. And next, you can also check out the Scale plan. Uh, you can, what, can you do, what you can do here is to consolidate feedback and create your first insight. You can prioritize and plan features using the user impact score, set up customer feedback integrations, share and validate features or feature ideas with customers. This one, <clears throat> okay, every, everything in pro, connect strategic objectives to prioritization, manage multiple products release, segment customers using CRM data. And then you can go ahead and explore more by hitting this button right here. But essentially that's it about product board, you guys. So if you are a business owner who, pro who manages products, uh, tangible or digital, um, it's worth to give it a try because of the 15 day free trial and you decide if uh, it's worth paying after the trial. Yourself. But that's it for this video, you guys. I hope to see you again on the next one. Peace out.